Hello and welcome to interactivelessons.com.au. My name is Susan Burke and I'd like to show you how to navigate the website so that you can get the most out of your subscription. Before we begin, it's important to note that you should be using Google Chrome as your internet browser to ensure that the files download in the correct format. Using other browsers such as Internet Explorer will force the lessons to download as .zip files. You can get around this by right clicking on the file and renaming the file extension from .zip to .notebook. This is also explained for you in the frequently asked questions section of the website. However, I highly recommend that you use Google Chrome for a better overall experience. So let's have a look at the website. Type in interactivelessons.com.au and we can begin. Once you've subscribed, the first thing that you need to do is log on. As an individual subscriber, you will have set yourself up with a username and password. If you have forgotten either of these, you can use these links below to retrieve them. As a school subscriber, your supervisor will have been emailed a username and password for all staff to use. So, once we've logged in, we're ready to search. There are many different ways to find lessons in the website. So, the first way is on the home page. You'll see some featured lessons in this scrolling bar. If you see one that you like, you can simply click on it and it will take you to the download button area. There's a description and a preview. If you click on preview, you can navigate through your preview slides using the arrows on either side of the page. To exit the preview, simply click on the small cross. You can also go to resources and browse via either lower, middle or upper primary or your free lessons. So for example, if you're going to browse in middle primary, that will just bring you to all the middle primary lessons that are available for you to download. If you are an individual subscriber, you'll notice that units of work are exclusively available to school subscribers. If you're an individual subscriber, you will not have a download button for these lessons. You can also change and look at certain subjects. So you might just want to look at lower primary mathematics, just using the drop down menus, and then browse through all the lower primary mathematics lessons. Another way to search for lessons is to use the search lessons area. You can type in a keyword. So for example, if you are teaching fractions, you can simply type in the word fractions and click on go. All lessons involving fractions across lower, middle and upper primary will show up for you to browse. Another way to search for lessons is to use Australian Curriculum Outcome Codes. This button here will take you to the Australian Curriculum website. So click on it, go to australiancurriculum.edu.au and let's have a look for a particular content description that we want to teach. So for example, if we go to English, you might jump to a year three description and let's say we're teaching some spelling. You simply highlight the outcome code, right click, click on copy and then go back to my website and in the search lessons bar, right click, paste and click on go. And you'll find that there is actually already a lesson there for you all about that outcome description. So then you can preview it and download. Once the lessons have downloaded, you can alter them and you can save them onto a hard drive, a thumb drive, onto your desktop, wherever you like and keep it for later use. Hopefully that has helped you to navigate the website. I'm always here to help. I'm happy to answer any questions and I also come to schools to deliver professional development sessions. My email is susan at interactivelessons.com.au and you can also contact me by phone 0409 522 556. 
I hope you enjoy using the website. Thank you. Bye.